So what's up people and welcome to another Warframe Fashion Frame video. So as you may know, uh, just a while back, uh, the most recent line of uh, Tenogen skins have come out. And today I wanted to make a video on one of them, basically the Scarab skin for Rhino. And this wasn't a skin that I was uh, extensively following. Instead, I was looking at another skin uh, for Mag, uh, which I'll make a video on later on. However, when I went to go get the skin for Mag, I just happened to come across this skin. And when I started looking at it, I was like, wow, this skin looks really nice. And so I was really impressed with this. So I thought I would get this skin as well. And today I wanted to make a video with regards to this uh, Scarab skin for Rhino. Now the developer of the Scarab skin goes by the name of MZ3. And this developer has made a few skins in the past. Uh, not too many, but all of them are of my preference. They are very exotic looking, but at the same time they are very, very clean in design. And I really like that about this developer's skin. Now I do own the uh, Devil Ranger skin for Mesa, and I've already made a video on it. Uh, I don't own the Lamia skin for Nova, but I have always found that to be a really nice skin. And of course, the Rhino Scarab skin is the one that I recently bought. So I hope that this developer continues to uh, develop more and more skins based upon his clean and exotic design. So there are a few notable features that I really like and I wanted to uh, present here. Uh, first is the Neuroptic. I really like this Neuroptic because it more resembles a Rhino than the default one and yet it still retains that space mech frame sort of look. On top of that, the uh, intricate color design is really good. It's very complex and that gives you the ability to customize, but at the same time, it still has that clean look that MZ3 is quite notable for. And finally, probably one of the nicest parts about this frame is that it's shiny. It's really shiny and that makes this frame really stand out. And overall, I think all three features together make this frame a really cool looking frame. So in any case, what I wanted to do was to make this quick fashion frame video so that you could get a chance to look at what the skin looks like in different color combinations. So uh, let's get started and let's start with the default colors that comes with this skin.
Well, that's about it for this fashion frame video. Thank you very much for watching the video. And if you have any comments, please post them in the comment section below. I will continue on and have more fashion frame videos in the future. And I hope you join us at that time. Until then, happy fashion framing, happy hunting, happy game playing. And as always, giant nice day everyone.